In the upfront setting, uh, there's a GOG study that will be opening soon, um, NRG GY019, which will look at newly diagnosed uh, low-grade serous ovarian cancer patients and randomize them to either treatment with chemotherapy followed by hormonal therapy with letrozole or uh, hormonal therapy with letrozole alone, both after initial surgical resection. And this will hopefully answer a question about how much role chemotherapy plays in the upfront setting for treatment of low-grade serous ovarian cancer. There's been some questions over the years about since low-grade serous ovarian cancer is a less responsive to chemotherapy, uh, can we replace that with hormonal therapy in the upfront setting? Personally, I feel that we, we don't know the answer yet, and in the absence of any prospective data, I still do recommend chemotherapy for advanced stage low-grade serous ovarian cancer in the upfront setting. Um, but I am eager to find out the results of this study once we can complete it um, in order to, to know what is the role for chemotherapy and hormonal therapy in the upfront setting.